it's so true. I just, I feel so emotional just sitting here and listening to that. SubhanAllah. Looking at the examples of our Imams, alayhim as -salam, each of them had a slightly different approach when it came to opposing the oppressive governments of their time. So, for example, take Imams Hassan and Imam Hussein alayhim as -salam. Imam al Hassan alayhi salam, he is criticized for signing the peace treaty with Muawiyah, even though he was following in the footsteps of his grandfather, the Prophet, alayhi wa alayhi, who signed the peace treaty of Hudaybiyah. Whereas Imam al Hussein alayhi salam, he stood up on the plains of Karbala, even though he knew that he, his companions and his family were going to be slain and he knew that the, his women, his daughters were going to be taken prison. Now, why is that? Why are, why are their approaches so different? Um, if it's different, it's because of the circumstances. Mm -hmm. Uh, in fact, Imam Hassan alayhi salam, he, he eventually he signed a truce, if you like. It wasn't a peace treaty. Mm -hmm. But if I, Imam Hassan resorted to that, was because he was about to go and, uh, uh, if you like, uh, to go to war. Because Muawiyah had made sure that he wanted to put Imam Hassan in a position so that he can fight him. Because he knew he had uh, far more resources and so on. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, Imam Hassan, what he did at the last hour, if you like, the last minute, was that he started buying off the uh, personalities where, who, uh, or, or, or if you like, the uh, senior figures mm -hmm. in the army of Imam Hassan, mm -hmm. and they betrayed their Imam, mm -hmm. and they sold out, and they accepted the money from from Muawiyah and and d betrayed Imam Hassan. That's why Imam Hassan was left with no option but to accept the truth. Mm -hmm. um, because, uh, because if he hadn't done that, the Shia would have been massacred. Mm -hmm. be because the, if you like, the, his generals, uh, his army, senior army figures, they betrayed him and they sold out to Muawiyah. He had to accept the truth so that the blood of the Shia would be saved.